Hey, you know, Reclamation Road is not just about uh, the human beings and the small towns and the vanishing middle class. There's also various others to protect in this declaration of interdependence. We share this planet with a lot of other beings and all of them need a little bit of space. So here we are doing a, um, let's see, what did Mr. Cheek call it? Subsidized housing for bluebirds. This week, coming to you special, is a how-to episode done in Heritage Salvage's wood shop by one of our fabulously talented woodworkers, Ron, Chris, and Mike. These are the wooden chefs. These guys have all of the cooking implements. As everybody knows here at Heritage Salvage, wood talks and we listen. Okay, today we're going to make a uh, bluebird house. Uh, bluebirds are a threatened species because uh, they are being kind of uh, evicted from uh, their houses by, uh, um, by English sparrows, uh, which are a more aggressive species of bird. And this is a simple thing to make, but it's uh, much needed for the bluebirds because they need subsidized housing. Okay, I uh, decided to um, cut out the pieces first and then uh, we'll, we'll brush them and finish them a little bit. That way we won't be brushing more lumber than we need to. The roof and basically all of the angled pieces are at 15 degrees. I'm gonna take these outside and we'll clean them up. Now I selected these woods because uh, they have this uh, nice paint patina on them, you know, uh, natural weathering and so forth. So I don't want to take too much of that off. Basically, about all that we have to do is uh, brush them and uh, maybe do a little sanding on the backs so that the uh, inside of the birdhouse will be nice and smooth. This side, I'm marking it different because I want the, the side of the birdhouse to open up. I'm using a countersink, you don't have to do that, but it's one of those little details that makes it look nice. I need a couple clamps. we have got to drill a doorway in it. on their bird houses. They uh, like to fly at walls and grab a hold of things with their, their claws. So I'm cutting some little uh, kind of non-skid lines here in the front of the bird house. So they can have something to grab a hold of with their claws. Way they like it. You could also use a little piece of window screen if you wanted to to do that. Okay, that's just about right. You don't have to be real accurate with this. I'm using inch and three quarter screws. This is designed so that the side can open up and you can clean it out. Um, and uh, it's kind of neat if you want to, you know, if you want to do it that way, to put a little uh, hook in there and uh, to hold things shut. All of the angles in here, the angles on the roof and these angles and e these angles and even the point on the stick was uh, at 15 degrees.
They like to have their houses about between about six and eight feet off the ground. I encourage you all to go out and uh, help subsidize the bluebirds. Thanks. Alrighty, so again, folks, I want to remind you Thanks for uh, watching another episode of Reclamation Road, and there will be a whole bunch more how-tos coming your way. And uh, so, whatever you do, remember, send us your two-minute video of your town to reclamationroad at gmail.com. And or, you can also, at any point, go to heritagesalvage.com on the home page Click on the Reclamation Road Show and you can join up where you will automatically be sent these segments. Folks, don't forget, Reclamation Road is also going to be bringing you how-to blogs from Heritage Salvage and you can find that on Heritage Salvage's blog page on the home page of, again, HeritageSalvage.com. So just dot com on by.